to Milne! Tip. Milne! The rest! Look at the tip rat! Black, now Sherman. Briscatelli, back to Sherman as they bring the house down! Laid it down for Cousin. Oh! G'day guys, welcome back to a weekly vlog. I'm gonna hoe into some food. Uh, last few times I've come down to the beach, it has been immaculate weather. Not today though. Not today, unfortunately. It is, um, it is raining cats and dogs, but that won't deter a bloody ham baguette being dismantled. Got a coffee as well. Got an arm and cap. Oh, it's treating season. Mm, just smacked down the ham roll. Um, been getting up at 7 a.m. every morning. Now, we flirted with the idea of um, early morning rising and grinding before at McDonald HQ, but seriously starting to make some inroads. Um, I get up every morning and me, Dutchie, and Mitter Bull have a Skype call over breakfast. <laughs> and it might sound stupid, but it's, it's helping me get up. And, you know, there's a lot of accountability if you're not on the Skype call. You bloody cop it, and I missed one this uh, this week. I was meant to get up at 7 for the 7.30 Skype call, but I couldn't get up till quarter past 8. But even, like, me getting up at quarter past 8 is a massive improvement, <coughs> so it's unreal. Filmed a little bit this week as well. Haven't filmed in a long time. COVID, uh, yeah, knocked me socks off, to be honest. It's, and, and, yeah, and once again, it's, um, you know, oh, poor Dosso, you know. Sooking it up over COVID when everyone else is in the same situation, but it it, it genuinely yeah knocked the uh, the wind out of my sails. And yeah, especially you know with footy content as well. I don't think footy content is banging as much <clears throat> as it would if it was a normal season, middle of July. But um, I don't think that's an excuse to not bring stuff out, even though that's been my excuse to not bring stuff out. Um, so yeah, I, I'm hoping to. Really pumping the videos out soon. I've been chipping away at a big project that I've flirted with telling you guys about for a long time. And there'll be an announcement very, very soon about this big project. Some exciting things happening. But, um, yeah, I love doing the Matty Rao mode. <laughs> um, I, uh, yeah, I, I, I've got plenty of ideas of players to dress up as. I'm pretty sure his nickname's Buzz Lightyear. I've seen some stuff about him looking like Buzz Lightyear, hence the Buzz Lightyear outfit. But, um, yeah, I've got heaps of players in mind that, I'm going to do like a, a similar video with where I dress up uh, to something that um, has to do with them. But yeah, had a lot of fun. It was um, good to, yeah, film film something dumb again. Just something stupid. But yeah, I reckon this back half of the year, I'm going to start consistently bringing some videos out. Hopefully the potty's back soon. Um, and yeah, just uh, take on the world. Um, and cap a clock, ladies and gents. Oh, I've had a big weekend again. And it's been a few weekends in a row, and I'm really reaping the rewards. <laughs> um, you know, really feeling it for a couple of days afterwards. And I don't know. Is it productive? Is it productive? Not sure. The jury's out. Probably not. But um, yeah, I'm gonna get an arm and cap. And then I'm gonna be uh, showing you my brekkie that I've been ripping into recently. Um, it's nothing. It's nothing too crazy, but it's. Uh, yeah, I just go to the smash to have a bit of tomato on some sour bread every morning now. Swapped out the oats and um, that's what I've been rolling with. So we'll get the cap first and then, um, yeah, going to whip up a couple of videos and I think that's about it. All right, brekkie time. Scintillating vlog content, by the way. But, um, yeah, got the almond cap and now I am going to make smash to have tomato and sourdough. Um, yeah, pretty much just a singer. I don't know, got a bit sick of the old, uh, the old oats every morning, so have subbed them out for an avocado and loving it. Um, doing bits and pieces for me. Apologies for getting a bit TV on you, but I whipped up the, uh, the tomato and the avocado the other day. That is a roughly smashed av. That thing was, you know, waxy. It was tough. It was tough to get through. So it's a bit clumpy, but, um, I was thinking the other day, does anyone else, and I think there would be heaps, just have like the shittest toaster maker ever? <clears throat> because we've had this one for at least 10 years and it just does the trick. It stands the test of time. And I was at a cafe the other day and I saw their toasty maker and it just looked putrid. So I don't know, 
Yeah, I don't know whether toasty making hasn't advanced and whether just the tried and true shit silver box like that still gets it done. Or whether, you know, you buy one of these for about 50 bucks from Kmart and they just last 50 years. But, yeah, just starting to warm up the sourdough. Here we go. Av. And then, uh, then some tomato whacked on top. I don't cook the tomato. I don't know if that's what you're supposed to do or what it's not. But, um, yeah, tasty. Love it. Gives me all the energy to go all day. All day today, boys. All day. I speak about a big project coming out soon, which will be revealed in the next week or two, but just to get the whistle wet. That sounds so wrong. What is the whistle wet? Like, wet the whistle. I'll, I'll Google the wet the whistle saying before I announce what I'm going to announce. Oh, that is a thing. Define wet... <laughs> oh, Jesus. This is dodgy. The whistle. Having wet a your, drink? Wet your appetite is a phrase meaning to sharpen one's desire for food, whereas wet your whistle refers to oh. having a drink. Oftentimes they are mistakenly swapped in the expression to wet one's whistle or to wet one's appetite. Well, I'm going to claim that I <laughs> used it in the correct term, not that I say many sayings right. But anyway, to wet the whistle, <laughs> um, I've got a song coming out on Thursday. It's called Cult Figures That I Miss, and it's a song about just old footy players that I wish still played. Um, in one of the weekly vlogs about a month, maybe two months ago, I played me discovering the instrumental. So, yeah, the cult figures that I miss will be out on Thursday. Yeah, I'm really keen for you guys to see it. I'm just playing around with the thumbnail, and I reckon I'll go with something like that. Um, I can that looks really sick, but yeah. Cult figures that I miss. Thursday. Cult figures that I miss on Thursday. Thursday. Cult figures that I miss will be out. Um, yeah, me and Jakey, Jakey Ross have worked pretty hard on, on this tune. So we're keen for you guys to hear it. But anyway, guys, I think that is the end of the weekly vlog. I appreciate all the support. I appreciate everyone who watched. Get ready for cult figures that I miss on Thursday. Get up and about. We'll be out at 4 p.m. And, um, yeah, enjoy the rest of your week. We'll see you soon.